Hi everyone, welcome back to a new lecture. In this video, I'm going to explain how to create an AWS command line interface user or a profile for your IAM user that you have created in the previous video. Okay, so to create an IAM profile for your AWS CLI, what you have to do is you have to open up command prompt in your Windows laptop. Okay, so if you are using Windows, you will have to type in CMD in the search bar and open up command prompt. Make sure that you have followed my previous video. So on how to download and install your AWS CLI on EC2 or sorry, in your Windows machine. So I'm demonstrating it on my EC2 instance because I've already done it on my local machine. So I, I told EC2. All right. So open up. Even it works for your own local machine also. You, you need not be inside your VM itself. As I've already done, I'm demonstrating here. Okay. So what you have to do is you will have to type in AWS configure. Okay. So just type in AWS space configure. All right. So and you can provide a profile name here. Type in hyphen hyphen profile and you can give a profile name basically you can give any profile any profile name but as you already saw in my previous video i have created an im user with terraform user and this is my access key and secret key that you already saw right so what you can do is i always prefer giving the same im username for the profile also but it can be anything okay i have just copied my terraform hyphen user and i'll provide the same thing here Okay, hit enter. After this, it is going to ask you for AWS access key ID. So you will have to provide the corresponding access key ID for your IAM user. So my access key would be this one. Let me copy my access key and I'll paste it in my command prompt. I'll go here and I'll provide it here. Hit enter. Okay, so next it is asking for secret key. Okay, so copy the secret key. So don't worry. So even if you're seeing my access key and secret key, I'm going to delete this user and create a new one. Okay, so here I'm going to provide a secret key. Hit enter and the, it will ask you for the default region. So my preference would be to go with US East one that is not Virginia region. I'll just say US. Okay, US hyphen east hyphen one okay you you can choose any region that you want okay but i'll go with us east one i'll hit enter and it is asking for the default output format so how do you want to see your outputs so there are many formats we have uh, json one such example would be json but even if you do not provide it it is okay right so i'll just hit enter without providing any value now, if you see the AWS has configured, so basically your username uh, and uh, your profile has been added to your AWS CLI. Okay, how to verify whether I am, uh, you know, added to the right thing or not. So you can run some your, uh, uh, you know, AWS CLI commands. Okay, one thing would be AWS S3. Okay. AWS S3 LS with the profile name hyphen hyphen profile and the profile name is terraform user okay provide the same username here okay hit enter basically it will display all your you know s3 buckets that are currently there in my particular aws account okay if you see here i have two buckets that you are seeing right now okay one is cf templates and the other one is demo bucket right so these are the only two buckets that i have currently in my account and that is being displayed here okay so if you are curious where this credentials are being stored what you can do is you can check that also you have that visibility so where you have to go open up your file explorer okay go to this pc okay under local disk under users okay go to administrator so here if you see here there is a file or a folder that has been created with the dot aws right if you enter into that folder you have two different files one is config and the other one is credentials 
okay so let me open up let me click on config and right click on it and i'll just open it with the i'll just open with the notepad okay i'll just start, click on open with i'll just click on notepad and i'll click on okay now if you see here the profile it is saying terraform user and that is a list and the region is us east one so if you remember this is what i provided there right so that is in your config folder or config file sorry next go ahead and do the same thing and verify what credentials you have in the credentials folder okay let me open up with notepad and click on ok here if you see i have my access key and secret access key for the terraform user so if in case you change your access key and secret access key you can come here and change here and click on save right next time when you interact with aws with this credentials it will be updated automatically right you will have to change it here so the path would be this pc local disk users and in users whatever the user name that you have in my case it is administrator and under administrator you have to look for a folder called dot aws and under that you have two files config and credentials these are related to your configurations okay so this is how you create your aws cli profile by using iam user all right so that's it for today's video if you're liking the content that i'm creating please consider subscribing and share it among your friends. Thank you and I will see you in the next one.